the F-35 program, known for its cutting-edge stealth technology and advanced avionics, faced significant delays over the past year in July 2023, the U.S. Department of Defense paused the acceptance of new F-35 jets due to hardware and software issues with the latest technology Refresh 3 TR3, upgrades. These upgrades are crucial for the Block 4 configuration of the jet, which aims to enhance its combat capabilities and ensure it remains a global leader in military aviation in 2024. The program made headlines once again when the U.S. military accepted 36 upgraded F-35 jets after Lockheed Martin developed an interim software solution solution that allowed deliveries to resume despite this. The jets are still not fully combat capable and are currently being used for training purposes only Lt. Jen Michael Schmidt, the F-35 program executive officer, acknowledged that these aircraft would be combat ready by 2025. Following continued software and hardware refinements during the delivery pause, Lockheed Martin continued producing jets at its Fort Worth, Texas facility however, dozens of aircraft were left undelivered, causing delays not only for the US but for other allied nations awaiting their F-35 the halt and delivery showcased the complexity of the F-35 program, highlighting the technical challenges involved in its development. The TR-3 upgrade represents a significant leap in the jet's technological framework. This upgrade improves processing power, enabling advanced sensors, weapons integration, and other systems required for future missions. However, the complexity of integrating TR-3 with the jet systems led to delays and the need for an independent review team to assess the software's status while the initial fixes have allowed deliveries to continue. The Pentagon is withholding $5 million per aircraft until TR-3 is fully validated the delays have impacted the broader F-35 Block 4 upgrade schedule. Pushing some of the enhancements further down the timeline the Block 4 upgrades, once completed, will significantly enhance the jet situational awareness, electronic warfare capabilities, and ability to engage with more advanced weaponry The pause in F-35 deliveries also highlighted concerns around program accountability and cost management. The F-35 Joint Program Office JPO, is now pushing Lockheed Martin to invest more in software development and laboratory infrastructure to avoid future delays The aim is to enhance the jet's capabilities without incurring further setbacks ensuring it remains the most advanced fighter jet in the world the f-35 program is not without its financial challenges from the outset the program has been criticized for ballooning costs which have only increased due to delays by withholding payments and pushing for better accountability the pentagon is aiming to keep costs in check while ensuring the delivery of fully combat ready jets although the recently accepted f-35s are not yet combat capable they are expected to be fully operational by 2025. This delay has pushed back some of the key milestones for the U.S. Air Force, Navy, and Marine Corps, all of which depend on the F-35 to maintain air superiority over rivals like Russia and China. However, with the TR-3 upgrade and future Block 4 capabilities, the F-35 is set to remain at the forefront of modern warfare, combining stealth, agility, and unmatched combat prowess in conclusion with 36 upgraded F-35s now accepted into the U.S. fleet. The focus shifts to ensuring these jets are combat ready and capable of meeting the demands of modern warfare the f-35 program is a testament to technological innovation but it also underscores the complexity and challenges of developing next generation military systems the pentagon's push for greater accountability alongside ongoing software and hardware upgrades is vital to keeping the f-35 at the cutting edge of global military aviation what do you think about the f-35's future after these recent developments share your thoughts in the comments below